Sodium. It is one of the, if not the best, performance mod for Minecraft. It allows you to double, triple, quadruple FPS in some cases just by installing this mod and doing some configuration. On top of all that, Sodium is for fabric, meaning if you like fabric mods, it's kind of your best option for getting high FPS. I have been asked if I would recommend Sodium over Optifine. And in truth, I think I would these days, unless there's a specific reason that you want to use Optifine. So with that being said, let's go ahead and install Sodium. First things first, you want to go to the second link in the description down below, and that will take you here, where you then want to scroll down and you'll find our complete text tutorial for getting Sodium. It goes over everything you need to know, so you can use the text tutorial or the video. It's up to you. Once you're here though, click on Download Sodium, and that will take us off to Sodium's official download page. Now, you may get this. This is the current generation of Curse Forge. If that's the case, come to the right-hand side, scroll down to the Minecraft 119 section, and click the orange download button here. However, some of you may have the new Curse Forge, so let's go ahead and show you how to download Sodium on that. Well, to do it, just simply click on Files here. So this is the Sodium page on the new Curse Forge. This will be launching soon. Go ahead and click on Files, and then you want to find the version you're looking for, which for us is going to be right here. When you click on it, you can also confirm that it's 1.19.4. Finally, click on the little arrow up here in the top right and click on download file. The download will then begin after a few seconds. So that's how you can download Sodium by coming to the right hand sidebar and clicking download here or by coming here and going through that process we just did. Now thus, we also need to download Fabric because Sodium is a Fabric mod. You can find Fabric in the description down below and that will take you here. This is our in-depth guide on getting Fabric. It truthfully goes more in-depth than we're going to in this video. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is because we're showing you how to install Sodium, not Fabric. If you have any issues with Sodium, come here because this article probably answers them. But now let's go ahead and click on Download Fabric, and that takes us to Fabric's official download page. On this page, we want to go ahead and click on the Download Universal Jar link here. That will then download Fabric in the bottom left of Chrome. You may need to keep or save Fabric depending on your browser. However, before we go on to installing Sodium, I have a message from our sponsor, Apex Minecraft Hosting. If you want to start your own Minecraft server, Apex is truthfully the best way to do it. You can find a link to them at the first link in the description down below, the breakdown .xyz slash Apex, and when you go to that website, you'll be able to start your server in under five minutes. We actually have it to stay back so much that we host every single Minecraft server we have on Apex Minecraft hosting, and if you do have any issues starting your server, Apex has 24 hours, seven day a week support. So if you want to start a server, look no further than Apex Minecraft hosting at the first link in the description down below, the breakdown .xyz slash Apex. But nonetheless, at this point, we now have Fabric and Sodium downloaded so we can minimize our browser. Let's move both of these to our desktop. Do that, click the little Windows icon, top left to my screen, bottom left of your screen, or bottom of every screen on Windows 11. Type in downloads, have this file explorer here. Open this up, and then we want to go ahead and navigate to, on the left-hand sidebar, this PC, and then downloads. In here, we will be able to find Sodium and Fabric. We want to drag and drop both of these to our desktop. Now, once these are on our desktop, we want to go ahead and start off with Fabric. Fabric is going to be what we use to install Sodium, so we need to start with that. To do that, right-click on the Fabric installer, click on Open With, click Java, and click OK. But Nick, I don't have Java. Well, if you don't have Java, you need to download and install Java 17. Java 17 is required for Minecraft mods, and of course, Fabric is a Minecraft mod, so you need to download Java 17 in order to run it. Or I should say Sodium is a Minecraft mod, but so is Fabric. No matter what, you need Java 17. You may also need to run the jar fix. It's going to take all the jar files on your computer and link them back to Java, making them work happily together. And it's also going to make your icons look like mine if they don't. But first install Java 17, then run the jar fix. And then finally, we can install Fabric by right clicking on it, clicking on Open With, clicking Java, and clicking OK. That will then open up the Fabric installer where we want to make sure 1.19.4 is selected and then click install. Boom, it's now gonna install Fabric. As you can see, successfully installed Fabric Loader for 119.4. Awesome. Now, the reason this might not work is if one, Minecraft is open, two, the Minecraft launcher is open, or three, you've never played Minecraft 1.19.4 before. If either of those are open, close out of them, reinstall Fabric. If you've never played Minecraft 1.19.4 before, just go play it, open it to the main menu, close out of it, and then you'll be able to install Fabric. Now we go ahead and click OK though, close out of the Fabric installer, and delete it. Now it's super easy to install Sodium. Open up the Minecraft Launcher, and in the Minecraft Launcher, you should have a Fabric profile. If you don't have a Fabric profile, well then I'll show you how to create a Fabric profile, but like I said, most of you should have it. And if you do, right there it is, 
go ahead and click on installations. And by the way, even if you don't click on installations, no matter what, click on installations. Then make sure modded is checked up here. As you can see, we unselect modded, it disappears. Check modded, there it is. If you still don't have this, or you don't have the 1.19.4 fabric, click new installation. You can name it whatever you want. I'm gonna name it Sodium 1.19.4. And then under version, we wanna click the drop down box here and select Release Fabric Loader 1.19.4 right there. That's what we wanna do, select this. Then once we've selected that, we can change the resolution. You don't have to, I'm just doing that so we can see better once we get in game. And we can click Create in the bottom right. We now have this new Sodium 1.19.4 profile. Now before you play, wait, don't play Minecraft yet. Just hover over either the Fabric Loader that was already there or the one that you created. It doesn't matter which one you use and click the folder. That's then gonna open up your .minecraft folder. And when you're here, you should have a mods folder. But Nick, I don't have a mods folder. Well, neither do I. So just right click, create a new folder, and title it mods, M-O-D-S, all lowercase, exactly like that. Open up your newly created mods folder, and drag and drop sodium minecraft 1.19.4 into the mods folder. Now we can close out of mods, and guess what? We can now play Minecraft, either using the profile we created or the fabric one that's already there, doesn't matter which, and we're gonna have sodium. It's that easy to download, install, and get sodium up and running in Minecraft 1.19.4. We'll meet you on the main menu to show you that, sure enough, Minecraft and Sodium is installed. It loaded so fast we won't even have to do a jump cut. So once we're here, we can see that it is fabric modded, but if we go to options, video settings, that is Sodium. Changes the entire GUI, also unlocks different settings, quality, performance, and advanced. So check out all these, you can configure them, and we actually have an in-depth video on configuring these coming in the future. So be sure to subscribe for that. We also have a video on shaders coming up, awesome stuff. So again, be sure to subscribe. But of those, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and enjoy Sodium. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.